highly anticipated video. I'll be doing Sword Achilles versus Union Valtriac. Now I say highly anticipated because I got a lot of requests for this after the first inverted rivals video I have done, which was between Wizard Luinor and um, Zone Fafnir. Um, so if you haven't seen that, go please check that out at some time. Oh, if you don't get the gist of this inverted battle thing, all right. So I I just took the layers off. Well, I mean, I, I, be, I put these in pieces. Okay, it should be like this. Sword Achilles, Union Valtriac. Then remember, the stock, well, the original anime combos were Sword Valtriac and Union Achilles. And when you look at this, when you take this off, boom, you get Union Achilles and the colors actually match. Here, Sword Valtriac. The colors actually don't match in a way with the Valtriac. But they do match with Achilles. As you can see, the yellow really, it really does match the Union Swords. And what someone else had pointed out to me, I think someone pointed out to me, or I probably realized it's on my own. I don't know, I don't remember. But, uh, okay, so we have the original Union Achilles right here. And when I take the chip out, of course, you see these blue Union Swords, take these off. Boom, you can have the yellow ones on here. And what's funny, this is a nod to Infinite Achilles. Because Infinite Achilles has a infinite sword mode and an infinite shield mode. The swords were blue, shields were yellow. Here you go. Hasbro does a lot of nods with Achilles. Like, I remember they had this Turbo Achilles recolor that was a legit nod to Union Achilles. As you can see right here. So, Hasbro... <laughs> When they do these recolors, they know what they're doing, for the most part. Which I do, which I do. Five point battles in this stadium, which makes the most amount of sense because both of these bays came from the same Extreme Challenger set. Just like the stadium, so we can let that. Wow. Okay, um, that was easy. It's now two to zero. So, Union Valtriac, uh, oh no, oh, I'm not sure. Union Valtriac looks really good. Oh, I started in power mode. And it's just, a, it's, it, it is a union. So, I'm gonna do five, well, well five point battles with in power mode, and another five point battle in speed mode. I think either way it's gonna win, but I've got the same. Yeah, Union Achilles has this um, leprechaun theme that I'm really digging right now. Funny, because my favorite cereal is Lucky Charms. <laughs> so, uh, it also plays a little factor in it, I guess. Okay, here we go. Easy win. Valtriac. Okay. Valtriac has the dominated in power mode, so we shall change it to speed mode. Alright. Three, two, one, let up. One thing I don't like about Oh, easy look at that burst. One thing I don't like about Sword Achilles is that it's stuck. I mean no, sorry, what am I saying? No, I'm talking about Union Union Hughes. It's stuck with the, the well, I can't say it's stuck with it, but they gave it kind of nerf. Like they didn't really give it good parts. Like Union, well, Union Valtrek, excuse me, doesn't have good parts. It it comes with um, I don't know what this good is, but it's like an older disc. You can't put a frame on it, and I guess I mean it's like I know they they need like light disc, but why make a well, why bring back older discs when you can just make new ones? Or like, they could have put it on a Hasbro exclusive disc at the very least, but they just had to give it whatever disc it is. I got to look after this video, well, this battle. But uh, they also gave it Destroyer Hyper Spear, and Destroyer Hyper Spear is not that good. It looks cool, but it really doesn't perform well. It runs out of stamina way too quickly for a Hyper Spear driver. 
You could argue that a lot of hypersphere drivers drop stamina, a lot of stamina, but uh, destroy a hypersphere, no, it, it no. I mean, it's, it seems like it's doing okay right now because it's sitting in the center, but it's like, it's not that aggressive for an attack driver. It's weird because it's hypersphere, you would think. Oh, and it somehow beat dimensional hypersphere. That was out of sheer luck. I'm blaming Sword for this. Also, also, isn't this on boost? Yeah, it's on boost. What? I don't know what's up with them in old discs. This is, oh, this is the A disc. I can't, I can't remember the name. Was it Armored? Bruh. Oh. He's gonna let I would get a little... Oh. Well, video over, I guess. That was very fast, and... You know what? Because it was so unrealistically fast, how about I do... I'm just gonna do one round. This one. Let's give Achilles a little bit of a, a heads up here. Let's give him some... Love. I'm actually gonna do a battle with it like this. I'm still gonna give it a um, boost and dimensional hypersphere, which is funny. This, this, it's funny how they gave sort of Achilles dimensional hypersphere because dimensional hype, well, but dimensional or dimension in general is a, a Achilles driver, really. Yeah, that's where it really came from. All right, Brett. Sword Bastard versus Junior Achilles. And as you can see, Sword is just not that good. Even with the Valtrek chip in there. It, the Valtrek chip is, is probably the best thing that comes off of the original Sword Valtrek because it has good slopes. But uh, everything else is like, no. Yeah, obviously, in my opinion, it's, it, when it comes to stock, it's so obvious that Union Valtrek is the winner. And Sword Achilles is um, sadly nerfed, but... Hey, is what it is. Alright, thanks y'all for watching. Have a good day.